One question we frequently have customers ask is, how do I get rid of an autocorrect, autocomplete for a two email address that is just the wrong one? Sometimes they keep using one, they're trying to send it to something else, but because the name is exactly the same, they get stuck on it. So I wanted to do a quick demo of how to do that, in particular in Outlook Web Access. This works in the Outlook standard desktop application and in many other email applications as well. So it's worth watching even if you use something else. So here we go, we're writing a new email, sending it over to BCC, so our team. And oh, look at this. Look at all these emails that start with BCC. So you can see there's a myriad of choices you could accidentally end up hitting. And the default is this text address. But say we're trying to send it to support. Well, I can't remember it's exactly support, but you don't want it to go to text automatically when you start typing BCC. So how do we fix that? Well, you can take any of these and when you highlight them on the very far right, there's this little X. By clicking on that X, it's going to automatically take it out of the list. So now next time you write a new email, that will not pop up as one of the autocomplete options. And the way those get in the autocomplete is simply you have sent an email to it in the past. So a lot of people go, you know, why did I get that? Well, if you reply to an email from that address or if you have a business card and you send an email to that address, that's gonna automatically add it to your autocomplete list. So that is the quick and dirty way to get items out of your autocomplete list. Thanks for watching.